Lower will come back to deliver us Mars. The last episode we got separated from our crew and crash landed on Mars, so now it's a fight for survival. Okay, here we are. Just gonna check if there's anything here we can use before we leave. Just, you know, for good measures. That's a very short skid mark, though, for... Like, it was to come down. It kind of come down. I don't know, it seems weird. Like, we don't have much cho many choices here, right? You can see there's, like, cliff walls all around us. So, I think that opening over there is the way to go. Sarah and Ryan was in the other skate pod. Um, they did launch quite a bit before us, so, I mean... Even though it was just a minute or two, uh, they could be hundreds of kilometers away from here. Is that a dust storm out there? Sarah, Ryan, please come in if you... That can't be good. Oh, hello. That's... That's the rocket from the start of the game. Okay, we're here. We're running out of oxygen, though. But there is an entrance here to something... That does look like it could be pressurized. That looks like an airlock? Yeah, that's an airlock. Oh, God. Okay, this could be good. Let's get in here. How do we... How do we operate this? Oh, it's automatic? The station replenish my oxygen. What? How is there still oxygen here? Well, there are probably people that survived here for quite a while. That's a lot of construction. What is this? Yeah, that's a mine. What is this facility? Yeah, exactly. Excavators, cranes. This looks like a quarry. Mm, there's a cow over there. A river. Let's hope it's functional. Yeah. How do I get up there? What are we doing here? Oh, there. That should get us up to the river. Yeah. Let's make our way down there so we can take that elevator. Got it. Okay. So, it's in situations like this where, like, since the dust storm is, like, there, I would probably actually just shelter in this that I know we have oxygen and, and, and it's kind of functioning and we can survive in there and just ride out the storm because, I mean, I'm not familiar with the, with, with Mars and, and their dust storms and how quickly they move in, but my guess would be that, um, I don't know, I would, I would hunker down and wait for now. Uh, and then make a move after the dust storm has passed. Okay, so there's like, oh, we can cr we can climb on this. Okay. So either I guess we could just walk down the steps here, or we can climb. There we go. Okay, so oh, the controls for this. What do I then? What do I do now? I can't get a pig in there. And I can't get it low enough. So okay, well, here's what we're gonna do. Um, we're gonna release both the pigs, and then we're just gonna drop past this little ledge and then slam the pigs into the rock below. <laughs> Look at that. Okay. Okay, we made it part way down. We're down that cliffs now. Well, made it down. Oh, elevator doesn't seem operational. There must be a way to power it. Yeah, I guess power's down. Okay, good. So, um, probably in here would be my guess. Uh, okay, just try to crawl up here, see what we can find. I mean, the doors and that airlock on the other side kind of worked, so some kind of power is available. Oh, here we go. There's power here. Let me go, please. I made a mistake. Please, Mr. Johansson, please calm down. I don't need to go back to Earth. Come, come, coming here was a mistake. Please, please, I, I just want to... Isaac, you're confused from the cryo. Try to calm down. I don't need to calm down. I need to go back for my daughter. Yeah. That's I her dad. I know you are smarter than this. I know that deep down you understand that what you are saying is foolish. Please, William. Please, let me go back to Earth. How do you imagine that would go, Isaac? How do you think you would be welcomed? With fanfare or police escort? 
going back won't bring you any closer to ever seeing your daughter again. I know you know this. You and I... If we ever return to Earth, we'll be tried like war criminals. They will treat us like traitors to the human race, not as its saviors. The only way you'd get to see Kathy is from behind bars. We need to focus on the here and now. We need you here, Isaac. Can I count on you, old friend? Rest first. We'll get your quarters and habitats cleared out so you can clear your head, okay? But yeah, that could have been years ago that that hologram was from. So, there's no telling if they're still alive, especially since the crew has been abandoned, so something clearly happened. Um, okay, well, let's see. We need to find some power somewhere. And that storm is coming closer. That swinging platform. Are you kidding me? Maybe I can grapple onto it. Oh, that was the last minute. Oh my god, that was a little bit closer than I like. Okay, wait, wait, wait. We need to get over to this side here. This seems hazardous, at best. But if we swing over here, like there, we should be able to just let go. And I'll probably get out of the way. Oh, can we make this jump? I think we can. Yes, we can. No problems. Oh, they carved this into the, into the mountainside. Let's get some lights here so we can see what we're doing. Hey, let's try to decrypt this. Get this at the right angle. I still can't believe it, Isaac. In my wildest dreams, I didn't dare to see numbers like this. You keep living up to your name with every project you get your hands on. Look, his uh, Our dream is coming to life. His changed. Now it's the same as all the others. There you are. Rosa, join us. We're just celebrating. Isaac's ore crusher is performing well above expectations. Admissions are up again, William. 62% this last month. We need to expand the medical wing, and we need more staff to take care of them. We talked about this. It's only a temporary increase. I don't think it is. More staff? Are being From where? <laughs> and burning out too fast. More and more are showing symptoms of anxiety and PTSD. And with our outlook for the future milestones, those numbers are only going to go up. Isaac's housing development has just started. We can't spare anyone else. Let me rehabilitate them, William. Give me more space and more staff so I can... We can't afford to take people off the ground crews to rest and even more to support them. That will only prolong our struggles. The answer is no. I'll see both of you at the weekly debrief tonight. Rosa, meet me in the medical wing. I might be able to help you out. Did it. Okay, we're back out again. We must be close to that power thing now. Can't be far. We have to go inside again, another airlock. Here we go! That's the RP for the stream tower, right, Ayla? Okay, let's power it up. Okay, what do we have here? So... MPT power reduction field. Power input reduced on contact. Supports multiple beams. A resistor. Ooh. Did Dad make these? Okay, so we can reduce the precursor. We have... Ah, okay, you see here. We have one here. Right? And that has three bars of power. And that should probably open up the second one. Oh, we need to cut it open. Okay, got it. But this one has four bars of power, but this one you can see needs two. And I'm guessing if I power this in there, it's not gonna work. Yeah, you see? It has it has too much power. But if I put this here... Oh, it only removes one. Oh, 
Oh, okay, okay, I see what I have to do. So we need to walk in with this. And then probably put it down in front of this thing, like, approximately here. So let's just put that there. But now, if we take this, we can potentially shoot it through the resistor. Reducing the power output, and we're good to go! There we go! Now that was nice. So now what? Do we get out of the airlock here? We did a thing, right? Oh, do we need to go in and activate something in there? But how are we supposed to go in there at the same time while... Well, maybe... Hold on, let me try something here. If we put this thing back there... I thought I solved this puzzle, but no! It was more difficult... Oh, and now... The, okay, so I need to be in here... Because there was... But it was on, and I have a joystick here, but I need... Yeah, because I need to point that the right direction. I need to be able to go in. And it said... Oh, this supports multiple... Ooh! Oh, hold on, hold on. This one has... So I need to place this so that... Oh, now I get it. Okay, wait. So I need to place it in such a way... That this one goes through there. But this one also needs to be able to go through it. Okay, so the crossing point of the beams. So where the beams cross... Beams cross right there. So that's where we need to place this thing. Okay, now I get this. Okay, wait, so shoot that there. Put that down around there, should be good. Mm, I'm missing something, aren't I? There we go. Now the thing is powered on. And this thing... ...goes through it. And okay. now... that looks good. Doors open and the thing is powered on because they both go through the resistor at the same time. And now we can go and we can activate this. Yes. Then we need to point it there. Connect. Got it. Okay, we're back at the elevator, and if we are lucky, this thing is working now. At least there's a button we can press. I think we can go up now. Oh, uh, the storm's getting worse now. Yeah, of course it's gonna. S yeah. Uh, can we get out of this, like, now, please? Oh, here we go. Oh, God. Can I... We've got to jump, Hayla. Yeah, let's go. Okay, where are we going? Uh, where's the good... That's a good place. I guess... That direction over there. Okay, that's a ledge over there. We can probably get up from that. Let's try that. That should do it. Up we go. There we go. Okay. Now what? Oh, that's... Please, no. Oh, that's gonna fall, isn't it? Right, we gotta give it a go anyway. And get up. And then it falls. There we go. Okay. Well, no one's coming up that way anymore. That's for sure. Okay, we got more climbing to do. We need to scale this now. Probably have to go to the rover. Some kind of storage facility here. Oh, that's the rover. That's pretty, pretty bearish. Uh, that's, that's broken. Oh, this one. Oh, this one's less broken. <laughs> okay. Get inside. Please work. Oh yeah, we got power. Or maybe not. Maybe it did. Kathy to Sarah and Ryan. If you're getting any of this, 
found a rover and I'm waiting out the storm to head to the Ark. Clever move. There. I like how the how Ayla is on top, just like R2D2. <laughs> Good luck, rest later and um, it seems like the storm might have passed yeah and Rover magically started working great to now. Well, it's an arc ship, obviously, but... Ooh, we actually do get to drive it. I was wondering if it was just gonna be a cutscene. Um, F to exit. Wait, so can we just exit anywhere we want? It would seem so. Yes, we can. Okay. Other than that, it's just a WASD to drive and B to brake. Okay, let's go. Hold on. Do you guys see this? Looks like there's tire marks down here and they are not made by me, all of them. Interesting. Wait, follow the light or the quest marker. Yeah, look at that. There's definitely tire marks here. Somebody else has been driving here. You can see that there on the side? and continue the mission. Please. Oh, there they are. We just made it to the big monolith. Where are you? I managed to salvage her over. I'm heading to the Ark now. Good. We'll see you soon. And Kat, if you need to talk, I'm here. No, I... I'll see you soon. There's a working elevator underneath that will bring you right to us. We're waiting for you to go further. Stay safe. Okay, this is not them, but it's something. There's something here. Yes, this is their escape pod. Okay, so they landed closer to the uh, to the arc ship than I did. Um, but I have a rover, so I should be able to catch up to them. They said they made it to the monolith. And this was an elevator. So let's keep going. There it is. That wasn't too bad. Oh, small, like, living quarters. I guess this is a good uh, place as any to leave a rover. Can we go into these? Just gonna check around. Almost looks this one almost looks like an observatory. Like 
put a telescope in that. It's not like there's much light pollution out here. Not sure what that light is supposed to be. That's supposed to be the sun, but why is everything blue? It looks like it's night, because, I mean, Mars has moons. There's two small moons, Phobos and Dimos, but... Surely there would be two, like, they're very, very small and not big enough for any, like, significant moonlight, I think. <laughs> okay, great. So you drive for, like, five seconds and, and, and then there's a, a blockade. Clearly, again, game telling us, nope, ro ro rover grows no further. But there it is. The Ark ship. I wonder if people are still here. But where is... Where's Ryan and Sarah? Oh, uh, there was... Okay, they said they found an elevator. That's from the elevator. Okay, let's go in. So while the elevator is taking us up into the Ark ship, I think this is a good place to call the video for today. If you want to figure out what is inside it together with me, then do stay tuned to the channel for the next episode of Deliver Us Mars.